and then performance process flow. Uh, it, it is one of the important question in the interviews, uh, performance process flow, a uh, sequence of flows. So whenever uh, any, any organization is implementing a performance management model, they would like to manage the information, nothing but the performance information in a sequence order. So what are the different processes they'll be executing in a, in a sequence order when, when the performance is going to be measured here? Okay, so first setting the goals. Every company will set the goals. Either manager will set the goal or employees can set their own goals and they can go for complete the task to set those goals. So that, that's the first one they will be performing here it is. And the second one is, so after setting the goals, worker self-evaluation and manager self-evaluation. So worker self-evaluation and manager self-evaluation. So both persons can go for evaluate the information self. Either manager will set the information or worker also can give the self-rating. So here it is. And then if there are any participants, whoever is participating in this performance uh, cycle, like there might be some peers, peers means colleagues, or previous manager, or some other uh, uh, internal customers. So these people also can go for involved in this performance document and they can go for participate and give the comments and give the ratings and they can give the feedback and we can manage uh, who will track all this information, whatever they have provided, who will track all this information, whether manager or worker will find all those details here. Then once it is completed, we'll go ahead with the approvals for this performance process. So approvals, after completion of the approval, then a review, then we are going to have the meetings uh, where the workers can uh, acknowledge the review meetings and managers uh, must acknowledge the review meeting. These all setups will be done. So whatever the four options we have, this four we are supposed to enable. This four are very important in the interviews they'll ask us. The first one is setting up goals. This is the first process. Second one is worker self-evaluation and manager self-evaluation. The third one is a participant feedback and then approvals, reviews, and meetings uh, we are going to. So this is uh, about the performance uh, process flows. When we are going to enable these checkboxes, we have to be very careful whether it's going to be applied at management level or worker level. We can see the task names. If at all we want to change these task names, we can go for change. For example, the task name is setting goals. I don't want to have this name. I would like to have a different name that can be changed in this particular tab here. Okay. This is about uh, the sequence of processes which we will apply in our performance uh, template. Okay. Yes.